Sumitomo Mitsui Financial Group joins the New York Stock Exchange as it becomes the first Japanese company to celebrate its listing since November 8, 2006. With us now is Teisuke Kitayama. He is the president and director of Sumitomo Mitsui Financial Group. And Mr. Kitayama, uh, great, to, uh, great to see you there. And I know uh, you're in a celebratory mood, but uh, give us a sense of why now? Why are you listing now in the New York Stock Exchange? Okay, now, uh, it's been a long-standing objective uh, to have our shares listed on the New York Stock Exchange. We started this uh, preparation work since uh, a few years ago, mm -hmm. and now the finery on uh, November the 1st, today, has come. And so despite the, you know, the current circumstances, uh, you know, uh, the surrounding the global economy, right. uh, it is our uh, objective, our targeted issue uh, in a medium to longer term. Okay, before we talk about the global circumstances, uh, is this listing part of a move to acquire or expand U.S. banks? Well, the... Uh, the objective of our listing shares on NICE uh, is to have much more uh, transparent uh, disclosure, to meet with the uh, investors' requirement, and also uh, the future options for us to further enhance our financial uh, strategy uh, in, uh, the, in the global market. Okay, but does that so, include acquisitions? Well, the, we do not deny the option, but uh, as of now, we do not have any specific plan uh, in that field. Okay. Uh, Mr. Kitayama, uh, your stock got hammered overnight along with other banks because the yen hit another 15-year high against the dollar. How right. are you hedging your business against a rising currency? Well, most of our uh, non-yen currencies businesses are hedged. Uh, by uh, procuring the, uh, those relative foreign currencies. That's and so uh, we do not have any, uh, internally we do not have any problems uh, in uh, the uh, appreciation of the Japanese. But uh, as a whole, Japanese economy for the time being is affected negatively because yes. of the negative impact over the exporting, uh, export-oriented companies. Right. And so the Japanese companies are now coping uh, further strongly the, to cope with the, this uh, changing world. Okay, then should the BOJ be more aggressive in intervening to bring down the yen? I don't think the intervention by Bank of Japan uh, would not be uh, quite useful. Uh, furthermore, it is uh, much more important for the Japanese economy to cope with uh, this changing world uh, under the appreciated Japanese yen. Uh, but uh, more important issue is how to restore the strength of the U.S. dollars in the global market, because which is uh, regarded as the key currency in the coming years as well. Are you very dissatisfied with the falling dollar? Well, the U.S. dollar's value uh, should be maintained uh, to a certain level uh, in the coming years. That, uh, that is my concern. Do you believe the U.S. when they say they want a strong dollar? Uh, well, I think that the U.S. dollar and also the currency of the euro would be maintained uh, to a certain level. Because What's uh, the certain level, Mr. Kitayama? What yes. are you comfortable with? Well, uh, the, uh, I think that the, uh, the current Japanese yen level against the U.S. dollar is almost the bottom. Because uh, I think that the, uh, for the further appreciation of the Japanese yen would not be likely uh, in view of the uh, level of the uh, Japanese economy. Okay. We're going to leave it there, but thank you so much. I appreciate that. Tasuki Kitayama uh, joining us from the New York Stock Exchange after listing there uh, the first Japanese company in four years.